Welcome to the session. Now, in this session, continue to the previous class, we'll discuss on fine aggregate and coarse aggregate. What do you mean by fine aggregate and what do you mean by coarse aggregate? This fine aggregate and coarse aggregate are very important in developing a concrete. Generally, aggregates consist of 70 to 80 percent of wage. Generally, 70 to 80 percent of wage of concrete is due to aggregates. Aggregates means fine aggregate and coarse aggregate. The in technical terms we call is a fine aggregate and coarse aggregate. But you are the first semester students, some of you may don't understand the technical terms. Fine aggregate is nothing but in general we call it as a sand. It is called as a sand. Coarse aggregate is called as stone. Coarse aggregate is called as a stone. Fine aggregate, fine aggregate is called as a sand. So, in a concrete, to develop a concrete, we require, as we discussed in the last class, we need cement, fine aggregate, coarse aggregate, and water. So, in the last session, we discussed about cement and what is the manufacturing process of cement, and what are the natural rocks are used in manufacturing the cement, and what are the box compounds of cement. Now, in this session, we'll discuss of aggregates. There are two types of aggregates, fine aggregate and coarse aggregate. This aggregate is very important as I mentioned here. It consists of 70 to 80 percent of concrete weight. Now, what is the difference between fine aggregate and coarse aggregate? This is both showing the name aggregates, but here it, the name itself is giving small idea. It's a fine and it's a coarse. The basic definition of fine aggregate and coarse aggregate is the difference between fine aggregate and coarse aggregate is if the aggregate which is passing from 4.75 mm sieve is called fine aggregate. The aggregate which is passing from 4.75 mm sieve is called fine aggregate. Similarly, coarse aggregate means the aggregate which is retained on 4.75 mm sieve is called coarse aggregate. The aggregate which is passing from 4.75 mm sieve is called fine aggregate and the aggregate which is retained on 4.75 mm sieve is called coarse aggregate. What is this 4.75 mm sieve? There are different sizes of sieves in our lab. In general, there are many sieves like 80 mm, 60 mm, 40, 20, 10, 6, 4.75, and 2.36, 1.18, and 750 microns, 600 microns, 450 microns, 300 microns, Likewise, there are many sieves are there. We consider 4.75 mm sieve. What do you mean by 4.75 mm sieve? If in the 4.75 mm sieve, there are small holes, which is diameter of 4.75. In the sieve, which is having diameter of 4.75 mm, is called 4.75 mm sieve, on which it aggregate which is retained on that sieve is called coarse aggregate and the aggregate which is passing from 4.75 mm sieve is called fine aggregate. Now, I hope 
the definition is clear. The difference between fine aggregate and coarse aggregate is the aggregate which is passing from 4.75 mm cu is called fine aggregate. The aggregate which is retained on 4.75 mm cu is coarse aggregate. And as I shown you here, there are different sizes of sieves. So among this sieve, we consider 4.75 mm. I hope this definition gives you idea on aggregates. And the most important thing in this session is aggregate consists of 70 to 80 percent of weight of concrete. And there are two types of aggregates which we discuss in this session. Thank you.